I, in an area where neighbors and police were seeing some progress. Yeah, police have singled out the university area as a trouble spot based upon the most recent crime statistics. And WCNC's Tony Burbeck is live in the mobile newsroom along North Tryon tonight. Tony? Yeah, guys, property crimes, basically people reaching into cars and stealing stuff like this. Well, that continues to be a problem up here. But police also say there's another problem that is actually in cars that keeps them from doing what they'd rather be doing, and that's fighting crime. What is that? That's people, drivers, who are often not paying attention to the road and instead causing fender benders. They use a big rock, throw it with all the force, so it shot at the door. The rock was sitting directly here. This is the impression. That's how powerful. Suddenly, Clinton Watson says he's a statistic. The owner of one of 25 university area businesses broken into in May compared to 10 in April. Burglars took two cash registers and a piece of him with it. To make you feel like you should just give up the business, don't even bother with it. Police crime statistics show burglaries aren't the only thing that rose in this patrol division. Armed robberies, aggravated assaults, and people getting stuff stolen from their cars are up. Fewer people actually have their cars stolen, plus home break-ins and shopliftings are down. Deputy Chief Jerry Sennett says the area continues to have several problem neighborhoods. We've sent additional resources to the university division. Four recent police academy graduates are assigned here. Watson says he'd like more patrols. Police say they often get caught up in something else. <laughs> working accidents instead of working to prevent incidents. A lot of um, accidents where people are running into the back of other people, not paying attention or whatever, and that takes officers out of play. Now police say overall the university area here got off to a pretty bad start this year that is and despite a few bumps in the road along the way overall crime in this area is trending down. We're live now with the mobile newsroom in Charlotte. I'm Tony Burbeck.